I have found in more tree stars for you to eat, Spike. Yup, yup, yup. Huh? <gasps> Did you see that? See what, Ducky? Something ran under this bush. But I do not know what it was. <gasps> it's a sand creeper. I've never seen one this far from the big water before. Sand Creeper. Welcome to the Great Valley. Oh, you are a swimmer. I am a swimmer too. Maybe we can swim together. <laughs> you are so cute. You are even littler than me. If you were all alone, I could be your friend. Yep, yep, yep! <gasps> well, at least the sand creeper is not all alone. Huh? All I see is the day in front of us. All I see is the day in front of us. Burning bright with a newborn sun. Come follow me. Hills to climb and valleys to roam. Oh, streams to follow on our way home. To the land before time. What are you doing so far from home? Sure are noisy little things. Are they talking to each other? If they are, Littlefoot, it's in a language no leaf eater can speak. Your shell is very pretty, little sand creeper. It is, it is. Where'd they all come from? What do you think it means? Oh, who cares? A few lost creepers is nothing to worry about. Didn't I warn you? I knew they'd be trouble. They're everywhere. That's what I say. I agree. You can't help tripping over one. I say we chase them back to wherever they came from. The sand creepers aren't so bad. Perhaps they do get in the way sometimes. Sometimes? Oh, more like all the time. I say, chase them off before more of them show up. Um, excuse me. I think that the sand creepers just want a safe place to live. A home. The Great Valley has always welcomed strangers. It would not be right to chase them away. No, no, no. Well said, Ducky. The least we can do is to give our visitors some time to see if things don't settle down. Oh, oh, I'll give the creepers a couple more days. But if things don't get better, out they go. Excuse me, watch it. Oh, hey! <laughs> Stupid sand creepers. If they're not careful, they're gonna get squished. Oh no! You are right! <gasps> Excuse me. Watch out! Try to 
look down at the ground. Do be <gasps> careful. Sand creepers are all around. No, 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 no. go back where they came from. Hey, why don't they go back? Because they're not smart, duh. But there's probably a reason they left their home. If we find out what it is, maybe we can help. But we don't know where they come from. I think they're coming from wherever they're coming from. We can just follow their trail. But someone must look out for the little sand creepers. Spike, will you stay here with me and help them? Hmm. Everyone else ready to go? The sooner the better. It's getting a little too crowded around here. to follow? Yep, let's go. <gasps> Everybody stop! When you are little, you have to be careful or you get squished it. Okay, now it is safe. We can go. See? We make sure everyone is safe. around these here parts. Huh? Hey, talk. We weren't gonna cross the log. It was for you. We're rescuing you. You? Rescue me? I... <laughs> hey, watch where you're going. It's you that got in me way. We were trying to help you. If and I want help, I'll ask. 
Snapper. Now then, who be you? I'm Littlefoot. How come you can talk? We've never seen a sand creeper do that before. Why, all creepers talk. But only old Scuttle here knows how to talk to leaf eaters. Why, I've been everywhere and seen everything. We're here to find out why sand creepers keep coming to the Great Valley. So that's where they all got to. They all ran off when the smoke and mountain blew its top. <laughs> Those Freddy Claws. Why, that be hardly a smoke and mountain at all. In a few days, he'll never know that smoke at all. That reminds me of a story. Once, when I was on the icy flats, not one, but three mountains all started smoking. <sighs> oh, great. He not only talks, he talks too much. Uh... Sarah, don't make him mad. Why not? He deserves it. If the mountain's done smoking, the sand creepers can come back. So? So, someone's got to tell them, and the last time I checked, none of us spoke sand creeper. So? So, we need Scuttle's help, or we'll never get the sand creepers out of the Great Valley. <sighs> Oh, all right. I'm sorry, Scuttle. What were you saying about smoking mountains? <laughs> As I was saying, not one, not two, but three mountains started smoking. Here we go again. Look, Spike, there is Snipper. Hi, Snipper. And here comes Shelly and Crunch. You know Crunch. He has the big claw. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, Spike, Crunch does like you. Now, them's was real smoke and mountains, I tell you. <laughs> Please tell me he's done. Uh, oh, telling tales makes me powerful hungry. Time for water greens. Come on, let's go ask Scuttle if he'll come with us and talk to the sand creepers. Oh, all right. No, I tell ye. I'm in no mood to be going to no Great Valley. But only you can talk to the Sand Creepers. Please. Please! Please. <laughs> yeah, please, whatever. Well, listen, I go. You'll have to gather a bit of grub for the trip. Well, that doesn't sound too hard. There! The back of that pool be where you'll find the water green. Under the water? It looks dangerous. I'll be under in the shade. A couple of you young'uns come with me. I feel a story coming on. <gasps> Greens. <sighs> Careful, Sarah.
you okay? <laughs> Do I look like I'm okay? You got the water greens! Yeah, now get them off me! And I look that old fast biter in the eye and I says... Here, chew on this! We got your dumb old water green, so eat up and let's go! Ah, that's powerful good water green. Okay, Scuttle, we can leave for the Great Valley now. Not so fast. If I'm going to make the trip, I'll need some more water greens. You what? Hi, a pile about boy. Yay hi. I'll give you yay hi. Sarah, we still need Scuttle's help. Let's just go get more water greens. Dumb old mucky water green eating Sam Graver. Your little brothers and sisters will never get to sleep. Can't you get them to be quiet? I will try, Mama. Pinchy, rattle. Do be quiet, please. Shh. 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 Be quiet now. I will show you how. Follow me and do not frown. The bright circle is going down. So please stop running all around. Find a place to sit still. You will feel calm. You will, you will. Be still like me and you will see how we can be so quiet now. Please. Some pile of grub. Well then, let's get going. Slow down, lady. Before we shove off, I need you to do me one small favor. I need you to build me a nest, see. What? Yeah, not just any old nest. That does it! Of all the mean and nasty, low-down, creepy crawlers! And you, Lassie, your tongue's as sharp as your horn and your heart's twice as hard! Sneaky! Stubborn! Liar! Loudmouth! You have to go to the Great Valley! Why should I? Because if you don't help bring back the other sand creepers, who's gonna listen to your dumb stories? Well, you got me. I do get lonely when no one's around to hear my stories. Well, what are y'all gaping at? We're off to the Great Valley. Ah, somebody grab the water greens. You see, Littlefoot, sometimes it pays to stand up for yourself. <sighs> Oh, rotten sand crawlers. Oh, they're everywhere. Oh, Snippity, there you are. Come along now. I've had enough of these blasted creepers. The next one I see... Huh? Let's 
Scuttle's telling them it's safe at the lagoon. Good news, everyone. The Sand Creepers will be returning to their home. <laughs> and none too soon. Goodbye, Sandy. So long, Shelly. Have a safe trip. <laughs> May fellow Creepers have given you a name, too. They call you Smiley Softshell. And if you ever need a friend, you've got a whole lagoon full. A whole lagoon? Oh, Spike. I will miss our friends. I will. I will. Well, there's nothing old Scuttle hates more than a long goodbye. So I'll just say so long. <coughs> Fare thee well till we meet again. Bye. See you later. Bye bye. So long. <laughs> we'll come visit. I got a few more stories to want to Mm-hmm. <laughs>